Hi everyone, Patchman21 back with another mediocre to, uh, to terrible unboxing. It's going to be super loot. Bullseye. Okay, so super loot. I'm assuming this one's going to be the May one. It's very light, so uh, let's see what's in here. Uh, oh, knife. Knifeless. So, t shirt first. And then some dark stuff. Black t shirt. Right size t shirt. Okay, it's a, a prism changing the, the light to the multicolored light, similar to what you would see on the. Um, I want to say Pink Floyd, but it's not. Uh, you know the, oh, the that albums. Oh God, my brain is just turning to shit. Anyway, that's that's it's a bit. Yeah. Okay. Okay. I'm not gonna. I'm gonna judge too much. It feels gorgeous. It feels really soft and lovely. So I'm hoping it will be. Um, to have like a good shirt, but it, it's a little bit basic. So I'm taking the double XL off because because uh, I was so fat. Um, okay, okay. It is what it is. Now yeah, there's a hat. It's actually very smart. Wayland Corp. Snap back. It's a, it's a wearable. Uh, Wayland Corp. Wayland Corp. Wayland Corp. Uh, I'll find out. I'll Try and remember to read the bloody manual afterwards so that we can see what that is. So I don't wear these things because I've got a massive head and they tend to look a little bit. Here we are. So Very last peg. Look at that. Last peg. There we go. Oh my god. I can see myself on my monitor. Oh, I look so ready for retirement. Anyway. I said quite like it. Um, there's a very good chance I'll wear that uh, with barbecue and stuff. So uh, not not too not too bad. I've, I've, I've gone out of my way not to get one of these. I've been intrigued, but I uh, I did go out of my way. So this is my very first fidget spinner. I'm actually really glad I got one. I really am. I didn't you know? I totally didn't want to get one, but um, now that I have. Oh, that's so satisfying. <laughs> Doesn't quite act as well as I, <coughs> as I would expect on a... Uh, oh, I can't. I'm trying to keep it level. Oh, that's not so bad. It's got a little bit of centrifugal force. There we go. There's a shake on this one. I'm, I thought they didn't have... I'm not supposed to have any sort of resistance, but uh, but that's no, actually quite attractive. It's uh, not just plain, it's uh, patterned. Of, uh, a bit of patternage on it, which is nice. Uh, nice little box. So, for my very first fidget spinner. How proud am I? And we have some uh, War of the Giants reinforcement pack. This is a Kiyomi uh, pack. I'm not really sure uh, what that is. I don't use this. Um, I'm pretty sure one of my, my friend's kids will probably like it. Um, Yu-Gi-Oh! I actually got an unopened pack of Yu-Gi-Oh! stuff and somebody mentioned it. Uh, I don't know if it was one of you guys or one of my uh, my uh, my real friends, people in the real world. Uh, but anyway, that's nice enough. I'm not going to open them because I probably would give them away to uh, to somebody, some, you know, some needy person. There's there's something else in here. Oh, it's a joke. It's, it's wedged in there pretty damn well. It's get it out. There we go. So we have the bandable, posable Joker. Now, when that says posable, 
as it may rubbery as anything can you can just mess around with them. <laughs> I hope so. Yes, it's it's an old school, old school fella. But I wonder if we know that you broke them back, man. No, it's that's sad, that's sad as shit, isn't it? Uh, no, that's all right. That's okay. Dad is going to stand up on my world again. Probably have to nail him to something. Hmm. Maybe he will. So we have that. Uh, that's that's everything. So I'm just going to have a quick look at the Dubry, the uh, this before I um, uh, I do the Steam code winner giveaway. So um, this is the uh, Super Loot May. Make sure I Waylon Corp snapback hat. Not bad for yo hum and yo. Oh, what is it? What is it? What is it? What is it? Uh, Dark Side of the Moon, Pink Floyd. What's Pink Floyd? Uh, Mashup T-shirt. The trading cards. The fidget spinners. Uh, the Joker figuring. Um, I still can't really think what it is. Is it something to do with? Because uh, I'm looking at that alien. So I'm thinking, is it is it is that the name of the uh, the corporation, the Whaling Corporation, that was uh, trying to get hold of the alien? Uh, you tell me, please, uh, if uh, if that is the case, uh, and I am correct, by actually cheating, uh, that'd be lovely. Anyway, I did do a giveaway for this particular game, which is the uh, uh, Keiju Panic. It's a Steam code giveaway, so obviously you'll need a Steam account. Um, the winner will get this code. Uh, what you have to do is email me. And what I asked for was your favourite cartoon and of that cartoon, your favourite character. There's only a handful of entries. Um, oh, I've got them here. Sorry, I've got them in little dingly dangly things. So I'm going to read them to you as I fold them and put them into this, this box, which you probably can't see because my costings are here. Um, first of all, uh, World of Stew had... Uh, he, he, Put, he put two in, but he's only going to get one. He had uh, Adventure Time, the Ice King, which was that one. Adventure Time, the Ice King. I don't know if you can see that. And he also had uh, Chalton and the Wheelies and Chalton. So that's uh, the World of Stew. So I'm going to use that one as his entry, and I'm going to fold it once, twice. God, this is fiddly. This is going to board a crap out of you. I probably will win this a little bit. Let me just put it, I'm going to just put it in the box here. So shall I leave it here so you can see what's going on? In the box. Next one is Keith Stuff. It was Transformers, and his favourite character was Hot Rod. So once, twice, and in the box. Next one is Skyway Fishers. And his cartoon was Star Wars Rebels, and Thrawn was his character so that's going in sorry i'm making a right dog's cock of this let me just there we go and that's going in next one is jay ace and uh tom and jerry uh and his favorite character tom so old school get in next was ricardo Dinoe, Dinoe, I do apologise if I'm saying that wrong, and he was wacky races and Muttley, and this did give me a few flashbacks to the uh, to that wicked laugh of Muttley's and that uh, metal, metal, metal thing that he did, which I, I used to love. Uh, I'm, I'm assuming that was in Wacky Races and Stop the Pigeon, but uh, in the box he goes. And finally, we have Geek Nirvana, um, and his favourite cartoon is Batman the Animated Series, and favourite character... Harley Quinn, and uh, I'm not a follower of this, but I have had a, a little look at them, and it does look like a fantastic series. I might pick it up if I find the time. I'm busy, I do work. So, Geek Nirvana in the box, and we're going to give it a little shake. I might just close it. I'm going to close it like that. <laughs> there we go. Nice, good shake, and um, open it up. And I'm just going to stick my hand in and just grab one at random. Uh, oh, here we go, and it is World of Stew, Shorten and the Wheelies. 
there you go so will this to you get in touch with me and i will email this to you now I, i'm reaching back i think you may have mentioned that you're not fussed about it but i'm more than happy to uh, to to send it over to you if you don't want it if you want to give it to somebody else um just take it and then just give it away okay so there we go i'm gonna put that to one side because i've got a brain like a sieve and i will probably forget if i don't who's won anyway thank you very much for watching um i'm still open for ideas for the uh, for the light box um anyway uh i've been patchman 21 all the way through this right from the beginning if you'd like to subscribe to me uh uh there i'm going to put it there subscribe there if you'd like to see uh, more of my offerings i'm going to put them up here and if you'd like to um uh, there help me out on uh patreon uh link down there that'd be very much appreciated anyway as i said previously i've been postman 21 thank you very much for watching bye now